This is the, probably one of the most important videos I've ever made because I'm going to explain how Blue Chew cannot work for you. Basically, how you can f*** it up. Basically, Blue Chew is a service that allows you to get Sildenafil or Tadalafil delivered right to your door. You probably know this already if you even click this video. And the good thing about that is, you know, it's all online. You have an online consultation to get your prescription approved. You get the shit shipped to your door. You don't have to go out and see a doctor. It's awesome. And if you haven't actually signed up for Blue Chew, the link down below will get you six tablets for free. You literally just, you're just going to click the link. It'll bring you to the to their sign up page. You're going to click their most basic package, which is six tablets um, a month. And then you can change that afterwards but just click that because that's that's what they're actually offering for free is their first month of their basic package which is six tablets now here's the deal it's not one of those things where it's like oh you know it's your first month for free but now we have your credit card and you can't get out of the subscription no no no. you can literally click that link below sign up get that first order shipped to you and then cancel right afterwards like literally right after you subscribe i've done it just to test it and there's no scam involved you can just pay 4.95 get your six free tablets and say go f yourself if you want to do that but after you see the convenience of the, of the product you're probably not going to want to do that again that link down below it's there for you to use it. But that being said, what I really wanted to make this video about is, so I use Sodanafil, but you can also experiment with Tadalafil as well. Tadalafil comes in a gray package like this, as you can see. And then Sodanafil comes in a black package like this. And the Sildenafil is like this little blue tablet, it's chewable. That's the cool thing about Blue Chew also, although there are a lot of services out there that are offering the same product to get chipped right to your door, none of them are chewable. Blue Chew is kind of unique in that way. But anyway, okay, so how can you f up Blue Chew, right? How can you, even though, cause it's not it's not gonna be, the things I'm gonna list in this video, it's not the drug's fault. It's not the Sildenafil or the Tadalafil that's not working. It's factors that are at play when you take it or not at play, you know, depending on how you look at it, that will affect your body's absorption and it'll affect your ability to reap the max benefits from the ingredient. So let me talk about that. Number one is you have to be using the Right medication and that may take some experimentation. What do I mean by the right medication? Well, sometimes Tadalafil works really well for people, and sometimes Sildenafil works really well for people. Sometimes both work really well for people, but guys get more benefits from Sildenafil or vice versa. But you have to experiment. So I was lucky in that the first thing I ever tried was Sildenafil, and that worked like magic for me. But I did go off and experiment, hence that's why I have some Tadalafil in my possession. But it didn't really work that well for me. I did get some benefits, but Sildenafil was just much more up my alley. And some people will swear by Tadalafil because well, whatever they have their reasons but you'd have to so number one way that blue chew may not work for you is if you haven't experimented enough to know which medication is best for you so once you have that out of the way that's one problem solved right now that for the next issue we have to bring up dosage so this is something else that you have to kind of do trial and error so you know your medical professional whoever you have your online consultation with they'll be able to guide you especially if you're totally new to taking sildenafil they'll probably you know be more inclined to start you off on the lower dosage side but if that doesn't work and here's the thing too like on the packaging it'll even say for example that i covered up my personal information so you guys don't stalk me okay so here's my actual package right the blue chew comes in that like kind of envelope or whatever it says right here chew and swallow one or two tablets 30 to 45 minutes before sexual activity right so i get 45 degree uh, 45 huh? degree 45 milligram tablets so it says chew one or two right so it's up to you to see you know what you need sometimes i've even chewed one and a half and that's all i need it just kind of depends anyway long story short you have to experiment with the doses because sometimes you know 45 milligrams might not do it for you or it might give you a little bit of an erection or it might help a little bit, but not enough for you to really fully enjoy and have sex. So you have to experiment. Once you get to a dosage that works for you, then you'll know, you know what I'm saying? And then you'll usually maybe either stick with that. Maybe, you know, you'll have to increase that dosage here and there, whatever, but that'll be up to you between you and your doctor, you and your, your medical professional. But that is another way that it may not work for you if your dosage is not appropriately set or high enough. Now, the next two are ways that I have personally messed up my timing and messed up my ingestion of the Bluetooth tablet in my case, Sildenafil, and it really affected my night, guys. So I don't want you to go through that. So these next two are really, really big and they really f***ing make a difference, okay? The next one's a big one, probably the biggest one that I think most guys f*** up, according to my friend group or my peer group anyway. The stories that I hear is food. So here's the deal. You have to ingest, right, the tablet fully for the Sildenafil to get into your system. Same with, same with Tadalafil. But... Most of us, we're going to get down like usually at nighttime, right? I mean, morning sex is a wonderful yeah, thing, boy. but let's keep it real. A lot of times it's after a date, whether it's with your girlfriend or just a girl you're seeing, whatever. Long story short, if you have dinner plans and you're going to go right back to a hotel, right back to your place, right after that, you're going to want to take your Sildenafil before the meal. And you're going to want to eat about 15 to 20 minutes after you take your Sildenafil, after you chew your tablet. Because what happens is your body is going to prioritize the food over the Sildenafil, right? So if you're going to have a big meal in your system before, and again, there are smaller meals that'll be helpful, but you're still, even a smaller meal, even like a f***ing Caesar salad, whether it has grilled chicken or not, right? You're going to have to di digest that first. So the Sildenafil is going to get kind of in queue. It's going to be queued and be in line to be digested afterwards. So I've had this happen and it's been f***ing 
fucking horrible where especially and it wasn't this particular thing i'm thinking about seared in my conscience i'll never forget it because it wasn't my girlfriend it was a date and it was a first time date and she was gorgeous and i wanted to blow her away but i took my sodanafil after a really big meal and guess what we ran right back to her place and it did not kick in for a while and what happened was i had to create like this awkward like oh i don't know what's going on i think i'm just nervous let's just watch some netflix and then i get two comedy specials later all of a sudden i'm like oh Oh, like the heaven, heavens opened up, champagne poured from God, and like I was ready to rock and roll. But then she was tired because we were watching Netflix for two hours. So yeah, we still ended up getting down, but it wasn't as good as it could have been, all because I mistimed it. So I had to learn that through trial and error. So again, have it before your meal. But also another thing too is I know this I'm getting a little meticulous here, but it's because I want you guys to get the most out of this. Shit. I don't want you guys to experience the pain that I have. The other thing too is you want to take your sodenafil and you want to have your meal after that, right? So take your tablet, have your meal afterwards. But then you really do want to try to like, I know you can't control this exactly all the time, but you want to try to have sex within a two hour period because the ingredients are going to peak out at two hours. Once you get past two, two and a half hours, the main ingredients are starting to get, kind of come out of your system. Every guy's different with this too. Even me sometimes, like sometimes it has been three hours later and I'm good to go. Sometimes it's been three hours later and I'm like, all right, I could feel the ingredients helping, but it's not like all the way, like, you know, so, you know, at attention kind of a thing. Because I know how I react. And I know what kind of direction I get when I take so benefit properly. And I know when it's being bogged down by my poor timing. Again, you want to have it before your meal, 20 minutes before, right? Not after a big meal. And then also after that meal, you know, don't try not to stretch it to two, any more than two hours, you know, just to get the max benefits of it. And the last thing I will say, this is kind of a funny one, but I got to say it. Some of us guys are plagued by this issue a bit more than others. Some of us are more self-controlled than others, but um, there is no amount, <laughs> there is no ingredient, be it sildenafil or tadalafil on earth that can work so good that like you're going to get an amazing reaction if you've been like fucking jerking off jerking off at home all day so you know one or once or twice in a 24 hour period yeah fine but i've had the experience where i was off from work i was home and bored had a date that night and thought to myself it's all good i can like you know rub a couple out and still be able to perform because i have blue chew yeah i have blue chew is amazing but it's not a fucking miracle like you, you got to have some kind of like you know umph left inside of you you know and also it plays into your desire too if you don't have any, if you don't have any f***ing fluids in your balls, then it kind of your actual sex drive is, is minimized. And so even when jerking off too much before having sex that night and using blue chew, even when it hasn't affected my erection, it definitely has affected my enjoyment of sex. So again, this video is all about how to max out the benefits of blue chew and how, how you can possibly f*** it up, right? Even if you don't f*** it up, you still are going to minimize your experience if you just, again, just to exercise a little self-control. Put the iPad away, my friend. Just close the browser. Anyway, that's pretty much it, guys. Again, that link down below will get you your first six, six tablets for free. I hope this video was helpful. If you liked it, you know, hit me with a like, hit me with a question. If you have any questions, just hit me in the comment section. I'll get back to you and see y'all later.